Dog Eight. bar with the headliners, doggy style. Who do we got? We got uh, Ray B, play bass. Bass, bass all right. John Bosco, guitar. Guitar. Mark Tolbert, vocals. Vocals. Alfred Cruz, guitar. And we're missing one. We're uh, missing a drummer. Davey Durr. He's over there. Davey is, uh, he's like our drummer. He's anal retentive. He won't yeah. leave his drum set alone. We should go over there and so. do it. <laughs> Alright, now we're here with Stevie. This is the most crazy interview I've ever done. Alright, so anyway, we're back outside here with Doggy Style. We walked over here to be with the drummer, but he didn't want to be part of us. When did each of you guys join the band? How long have you guys been in the band? Uh, I started the band in 1984. So you're from original man? Yes, I am. Right. He, he is the when man. When did you come in the band? 87. 87. 87. Alright. I came in in 85. 85? Me, I joined like a couple years ago. I did tour in 86, That's the big right. fun tour. With Cross Country with Tour? With the original yes. Doggy Style. Great fun! With the original oh, Doggy Style, style. Yeah. big fun tour. Awesome. Yeah, I play yeah. guitar on that. Tour. Yeah, yeah, I guitar playing in the food. Back Good. Back but his, his main squeeze at the time was Heavy Dirt. It was Heavy Dirt. Uh, which right. is a badass yeah. band. Yeah. We're talking about right. Doggy Style. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we're about, we took a heavy dirt and Stevie Dirt was in heavy dirt as well. A heavy right. dirt nap. How many albums did you guys put out? Uh one, two, three, four. Uh, I put out four. I, I played on four albums no, I put out. Okay, so side by side by side. Yeah. Here. Live at Sun City. Live at Sun City. Uh oh, don't Doggy Style Two. Two. And, and don't, don't, don't hit me up. up. Yeah, four. Four. four albums on it. A little known fact, we played with you guys in nineteen eighty seven. We were, at the time, we were called the Bone Tigers. It was the Dickies, the Bone Tigers, and Doggy Style, and like goodies. goodies. Oh, ah, 1987. Oh, yeah. After that, Brad and uh, Lou with the drummer left to start the Commonwealth Kings, and that's another yeah, thing. Okay, and, that's, and we that's, just that's we, we, and we kept on with Mark singing, and then uh, Boston and guitar. Then Curtis came to sing with us after that. How we feel it? Oh, yes. hey, we got Stevie. Oh, oh there, there he is. There he is. The drummer. So how long have you been at the Doggy Style? You've been well, I've been in, what's been, almost two years now since Curtis? Yep. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so we got together at, at the memorial. It was kind of round robin. Uh, just a bunch of us getting up there and getting our yeah, guys out. You toured with us that one. Well, yeah, wait, but wait. The, okay, so we did a tour. It was DI. The first national tour we did was 87, right? Yep. 87. 87. So it was Pied Piper. Doug Karen came out from the East Coast and he was working with a lot of the Orange County bands and uh, decided he brought the adolescents back and played, uh, what, uh, Lupos and a, you know, did a bunch of the East Coast stuff and then they brought us out and it was two bands in the van. Ten guys in a 15-passenger van and about three days before we were ready to leave, okay, Hedge was playing bass in DI. He was playing guitar in Doggy Style. And so he was going to double up. We were playing direct support. Doggy Style was playing direct support for DI every night, headlining this tour for a couple of months. Well, a couple days before we were ready to hit the road, Danny Stone said, I'm not going. So they said, Stevie, you're playing drums. So I guess I had no choice. So and I you did a great job. I played yeah, two, two sets three, every two night. Sets every night. <laughs> I the broke these fingers at TT the Bears in Boston, in Cambridge. We, we were about a month into it, and we would get at the end of the set. Everyone would kind of let their instruments off before long. It was everyone else playing playing the instrument except for the bands. We all jumped in the crowd. I jumped off the stage, got my shoe caught in somebody's lapel or epaulette in a leather jacket and was straight to the ground broke the, both these it's fingers. So not only did I have to play two wait, seconds every night. Epaulette? Yeah, epaulettes, man. I don't know what the hell that is. Epaulettes is, epaulette is like a, it's a military thing. It's like a, you know, it's a... Epaulette, what he said. Yeah, yeah, that, that, yes, yes. <laughs> so yeah, that, so I did that tour, but I came back and they were going to do the next record, and they didn't let me play the fucking record. But they did ask me if I could use my drums, motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Well, drummers well, are a diamond dust. That's why I didn't want to be in the interview. That's what I've been telling you the whole time. <laughs> he didn't, yeah, he didn't want to talk. Listen to him. Got, so with that break, when you came back, did you find that all your old fans came back? Or you have new fans? Uh, I really don't, don't care about them. I don't get my friends came back. That's all I care about. <laughs> Everybody yeah. leaves tonight, we're still going to play. The thing about it is, is like when we were in a room together, it's about us having fun together. It doesn't matter about if people like us. I hope they like us. Yeah. And we're trying to do a good shit set yeah. for them. All right. But, you know, we enjoy being with each other and playing yeah. music. I'm looking forward to seeing you guys tonight. Right. So thanks a lot for coming out and doing an interview with us. Thanks. We'll, we'll see you on you, our YouTube channel, yeah. 390band.com, yeah. YouTube, whatever it is. Yeah. We'll be out there somewhere. <laughs> thanks a lot, guys. All right. Thank you. Hey everybody, it's Ronnie X for the Punk Band 390 and you're watching the 390 YouTube channel. Hey, if you like this video, we really would appreciate it if you just click that subscribe button down below. It's that, that red button that says subscribe. Go ahead and hit it. We, we really would appreciate it.